right? We want to figure this problem out. So we're going to use the product rule. So we're going to take d dx of the sine of x times tangent of x plus sine of x times d dx of the tangent of x. So we end up here with this cosine of x times, I'm going to break the tangent down to its simplest components, cosine x plus sine of x, derivative of the cosine of x, or tangent of x is secant of x, which is, uh, well, secant squared x. Um, so if I keep going here, and actually what I'm going to do is break this down into 1 over cosine squared x. So what I get here is these cancel out. I'm simply left with sine of x. Um, and then on the right here, I get uh, 1 sine of x over cosine x is equal to tangent x, and then there's still 1 there's still 1, 1 over cosine x, which is equal to um, the secant of x. All right, that's it. I hope that helps. This could, could have been left as cosine x, tangent x, but it simplifies down. So, All right, thanks for watching.